There's no place to escape to. This is the last stream. On the left. <laughs> That's when the cannibalism started. Yay! Yeah. Sure. Hello. You know, another stream. <laughs> I can't believe it sometimes. Oh, yeah. You know, sometimes I get into this room and I want to pinch myself because I'm living the goddamn dream. I mean, that's what you said before we uh, went on air. You said this is going to be the one that puts us over the edge. Uh, and and then Eddie asked if, if, he, if he meant, and what I meant by that was to kill everyone. Yeah. Yeah. And the answer is yes. No. <laughs> yeah. It's good to know these details. Yeah. Yes, it's important. I mean, there is enough people in this room right now to make the newspapers. Oh, if you were hey, to kill everyone sure. in this room right now, like it's going to make the papers. No news is bad news. Yeah. Um, but it's not mean? your mandate this week. No, so, it's not. So we can't kill everybody. No, I'm not. I know. I know. But guys, I want to say what a great day we're going to have here. Mm -hmm. I heard some of the reactions of videos you guys were playing earlier today and people were gagging. Um, it's the staff picks yeah. edition of last stream on the left. And yeah, there will be a prize because we're voting again. Yeah. yeah. There are absolutely be, be, there'll be three again. rounds of voting and then we'll have a final round. Mm -hmm. There's going to be a prize. This one is is going to be $100 out of your wallet. It is not. No. <laughs> Henry, no. Yeah, Henry Kibosh. That I said no because I was, I was happily made to last time. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But this time we've picked a prize that I think you guys are going to like a little it's bit gonna, better. It's a really, it's something really nice. I think you're going to like it, really it nice? a it's something little really nice. bit. Okay. Yeah. Well, they I mean, appreciate it more or less than $100 cash. Less. No, no <laughs> way. No way, Eddie. Yeah. This is all about this. You're going to love the mm. way that you feel when you get this prize. Mm -hmm. Now I already see Northeastern Sasquatch. I'm so ready to see what horror the staff has in store this week. It's going to be rough. It's they've always been, disgusting. They've invariably been far worse than anything we've shown. I know. I'm yeah. excited. Honestly, I love this potential. Bigfoot Erotica says, sacrifice the loser. Well, there's we lots just, of losers. We just yeah. said that we can't kill everyone. Yeah. All right? It's not one of our mandates. We can choose to kill one person in our vicinity, but we'll wait for that for the fall. Yeah. Um, sweep, we, sweep. we got Travis. Yeah, sweep, sweep. Hail the dang staff, yo. People go fucking getting up. Happy birthday, Angie Scribbles. Love Angie. Happy birthday, Gurney. Happy birthday, Gurney. Happy birthday, Gurney. Yesterday. Yesterday. Oh, it was yesterday. Gurney is 45 years old. <laughs> yeah. I'm so good to have an elder here. Um, Margaret, does, it, did Margaret, does Henry have a crisp $100 ready? No, I do no. not. That is why we did not choose that. Gift. What All did right. you get Gurney for her birthday? We're going to get to it. Roach, <laughs> when the fuck we get Marcus's makeover? I believe it's going to be next week. It's next week. Wow. So it we got is some stuff in. Yeah. Apparently, there's some powder that had to be bought for this mandate. Oh, yeah. So buddy. we're going to see what that's all about. Um, Madam Kunani. My dog just had explosive shit all over the carpet in honor of her first time watching the stream live. Congrats. Stream in a stream. We're trying to get our stupid, uh, we're trying to get some cleaning done in the uh, upper floor of our home. We're finding lots of little shits. Oh. Apparently the dogs have done, they have kind of scurried to various corners of the room and have left. Tiny little shits everywhere. Do you think they've left pee pee's as well? Oh, absolutely. I know that they Lots do that. Lots of carpet up there. Where yeah. they do it is in my office. They come to my office and they've designated the office as the toilet. And I wish that they knew it is, in fact, the toilet. Yeah. Jim Strum, I've just powered through the first three dude books for the first time. Henry, be proud of me. Yes. That's a power. And I mean, I we went Those and saw the, good ones. the Dune Part 2 last night. Don't spoil it. You went? It's fucking incredible. Dude really? 2 is so, so fucking good. Fucking good. It's good. But we're going to get, I'm going to do yeah. LPN Deep, Dev, Deep Dives Dune. Yeah. We're coming back with a review. And I'll tell you this. I started the audio book this morning. Of what? Dune 3? No, just Dune. Now, this All Dune I do movie, is win, dog. Mm -hmm. All I do is fucking win. Well, I just started the audio book because I tried reading the actual book three times and it's 
fucking incomprehensible. It's better to have somebody reading it too, so you can get the words, the yeah. pronunciations, you can get the intonations. And do they use all the fake languages in the book? Of course, it's not fake. It's as real as you and I, my friends, because it's written in a book. Here's a glossary, so technically it is a real language. Frank Herbert, he spoke those those sultry words to his wife as he put a child in her. What is your favorite Dune word? What? What's your um, favorite Dune word? My favorite Dune word is probably what were we talking about? Um, oh. Apparaxis. <laughs> Apparatus. Oh, Apparatus is good. <laughs> the message with Dune words, like when he did the, when he created the term Quicksack, uh, Quicksack's Hatterack. Quicksack's Hatterack. Was that before or after the phone. song Nick Knack Paddywhack? Because yeah, yeah. that's every single time I hear Quicksack Paddywhack, all I think of is Nick Knack Paddywhack. Yeah. Philistines. <laughs> Don't understand the actual philosophical implications of what they're talking about. Sleazy Dan, how good was that Dune popcorn russy? It was sold out. Yeah. It was, it sold, was out. sold out at the press premiere? Yes. It has been sold out for weeks, I asked. I saw a guy. He got one, though, in our showing. He got one. Maybe, Maybe he brought it with him. That would have been That's weird. <laughs> <laughs> really? All right, guys. All right, staff picks. All right. Let's see what this is going to be like. All right, I'm excited. I'm so glad you guys did this and we didn't. So I'm excited. I'm not prepared. We've showed up. You know, That's all we need to do. We don't prepare. You hired the staff. Let's no, see I'm the first video. I love it. We're gonna be doing these batches, Andrew. Oh. Bush, 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 bush. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I think that that sells this is the little fart at the end. Oh no! no! There we go. That's how you fucking do it, dude. Not the landscaping. Yeah. Oh. Oh. He farts again. Did he fart again? He farted again. Oh. <laughs> this is a bad That's fight, That's a dude. crazy, weird, like, it was an intense fight, but, yeah. like, nothing happened? Yes. Yeah. It's like a, Dune. Yeah. A, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, a guy did hit another guy with a tree. That's awesome. That's expensive. Yeah, that is expensive. I like him kicking him in. I like, you know, a little fart. Mm -hmm. It was that's two cold. little farts. I know. Like, that's great. Because, like, if you get beat up, because that's what saves a friendship. You know what I mean? Like, that's a fight between buddies. Mm -hmm. And if you knock your buddy over and he farts a little bit after you've had a raging fight about, like, something. Fun, yeah. Everyone, you're like, buddy, I, this is why we're together. <laughs> like, it's like, you're a funny guy. This is a funny time. Have you ever had one of those? They always say that about men. About how men fight with their with their man friends, and then mm -hmm. they go back to being like friends again. When I was a kid, that happened all the time. Yeah, we beat the shit out of each other, and then we were friends. But past the age of like twenty, no, oh, no, no, God, no, 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 no. Past the, when you could really get hurt, that's when things change. Yeah, after yeah. thirty, I'm only punching Nazis, and and uh, when the government finally comes for me. Well, yeah. we did. Uh, we slowly uh, segued into slap fights. For a little while, like 20, 21, 22. Hitting the balls? No, no, no. Um, walking up to somebody and slapping them as hard as you possibly can at parties. Like in the back? Hit. No, in the face. Really? Just, yeah. Boys are icky. Yeah. yeah. We had boxing gloves and we would beat the shit, each other, beat the shit out of each other with boxing See, gloves. See, that's mm -hmm. fun. That's fun. One yeah. of the gloves was like fucked up, and so like if you yeah, got the connect. good glove, you'd actually hit people with your knuckle. Oh, Nathan yeah. says that Henry loves fun. when men grapple. I prefer women grappling. V3, how likely are you to get another YouTube ban this week? Who knows? Who knows? I mean, last, we, last week it was, uh, the last time we had a YouTube ban, it was for the skateboarder snapping his leg. And we I, thought that was pretty tame. I thought that it was, was normal. Tame. Yeah. yeah, that was yeah. normal, dude. That was just like snapping legs. That's science. That it was, was a great It news. was a great video, but, you know. I see people snap their legs every day. Yeah, yeah. Honestly, it's all over YouTube. It's all it was. We used to like, think about just mainlining live leak for hours. Oh, oh yeah. All yeah, those electrocutions. It. Oh, funeral sandwich. In, I love, honestly, the, the electrocutions we used to watch. Because you be, if you haven't seen a bunch of electrocutions, uh, it's very it's very startling. I only saw the one that was on Faces of Death, and it still haunts me. Mm -hmm. But I don't think it was real. The was one it the where one they put where the uh, things over his eyes, and his eyes started bleeding? Yes, that's, that was not real. That, no, that, that was, was not real. When the someone... one is the guy who was spinning, that one where he's spinning on the electric lines. Yeah. Where he's doing thing, and then you watch it go, and his whole body fucking yeah. jerks around like he's a goddamn snake. Mm. But mostly when people get electrocuted, the first thing they do is go, yeah. And it's silent most of the time. Yeah. It's like drowning. How dr drowning is silent. Mm -hmm. Kind of. I mean. No, well, well, you see, they say with drowning, <laughs> yeah. you just see the person going like. 
Eventually, and then they're fucking gone. Like but that, you just kind of like. But that's true for every form of death. No, yeah, no, 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 no. I'll nothing. show you a loud death. <laughs> <laughs> I'll show you a loud death. I can't wait for it. Yeah, Uncle Corner, but your uncle spent a lot of time at Rotten.com. You're correct, Jesse. That's exactly what's going on. Absolutely. You don't know how many. There's so many ways to die. We're just a pile of fucking meat. I'll mm -hmm. never forget the the page of the man being, the python being cut open and the man being inside. That was my favorite Rotten.com page. Yeah. The which one? Uh, where the python that had eaten a man and they yeah. caught the python and they cut the python open and the man was still inside. That was awesome. So fully remember, formed. We talked about this about the guy who was trying to get eaten by the python and live. Yeah, the and it didn't, it didn't work. It what didn't did work. You no. snorkel? He just couldn't get inside of it. Oh, he okay. wanted to wear a special suit, but it didn't work. <laughs> well, don't they kill you before they swallow you? Yeah. That's no, not necessarily. Oh, okay. Well, they try to. That's their goal. They try to, Yeah, but yeah. not necessarily. Nod Narb. Nod Narb. Been here since 2016 live. Fuck yeah, that's what I'm fucking talking about. We've been doing this show for eight years. That's a long time. It is a long time. Uh, George Lawrence, I want to know if Marcus is stoked for the Damned tour. I didn't know the Damned were going back on tour. Well, that's work. pretty fucking but, cool. I mean, it helped. is pretty cool, but I hear that these days Dave Vanian is quite old. Hey, man, you uh, got to see these guys before they die. We went to go see MC5 right before the very last member of MC5 died. And yes, was the was the crowd mostly seated? Absolutely. Yeah. But it was fun <laughs> at the time. Well, I went and saw television live, and it was the original lineup, but the drummer was too old, and he couldn't really keep just up boom. with the rest of the band. Yeah. He just... Boom. He just kept getting off a of beat all the time, and he couldn't do his fills right. It was it was kind of sad to watch. That's why I but think I it's important Tom to take him out behind a bunch of speakers and shoot him in the back of the head. That's the only <laughs> thing you can do with an old with an old musician. drummer. Yeah. 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 All right, let's go. Let's see this next one. Let's see. What, let's see what this next batch comes from. Next that fix. Okay, Madeline. Good. 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 You've selected the finest replacement one that money can buy. Yeah. These people know what they want. Why? Because before they bought replacement wonders, they sent for this free book. It's got all the questions answered on prime replacement wonders, and they're going to find peace of mind with Super Sage Wonder Company. <laughs> Super so Sage. If about replacement wonders, call 583-4855, and I'll send you this book. Better yet, I'll bring it myself. We'll get serious together. No. Call Super Sage at 583-4855. Super Sage. Super Sage. I don't want that man to come to my house and get serious. I want to come oh. over your house. I'm going to look at it. I'm going to look at your windows. I'm going to look at your pipes. We're going to get serious to get me. But <laughs> you know, I, as soon as the take was over, that guy was like, fucking nailed it. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm the best. I'm the best at this. I'm going to be president of the United States. It's me, Super Sage. But also, we, uh, he's probably got some choice words about select groups of people. I yeah. would imagine so. I would imagine he doesn't like your people. People, the Polish. Yeah. I'd imagine he's a lot to say about the Polish. What are you talking about? We're the best. We're the fucking heart of Europe. Yeah, people don't necessarily dislike the Polish as much as they like picking on the Polish. Well, yeah. The Polish yeah, yeah. is like a fun, uh, it's a it's a fun group to pick on, but then you find out that each, like, you know, the Norwegians got stuff about the fucking Finns and the But they Dutch also got the stuff fucking, about the Polish. Yeah, they everybody's all, got stuff about the Polish. But they all kind of have the same stuff. Like, I do believe there's like a Norwegian joke of like, you know, why do they take the Finns? Why do they bury the Finns with their butts stinking out of the out of the ground so they have a place to park their bikes yeah. and shit like that. They have been saying those things around a long time. We're not the only dumb race. Yeah. Yeah. All a that, lot of people are fucking stupid. All that Polish shit really fucking pisses me off, man, making fun of us for being stupid and shit. We're you know, not like stupid. Old, we are fucking openly fascist. Those old jokes <laughs> where they're like, yeah, you hear the one about the Polish hockey team that, you know, died during spring training and shit. That's you know, like people laugh. That's, that's, like, I lost two real, cousins that week. That's a real fucking tragedy. <laughs> yeah. Or even Marcus is laughing like it's some kind of joke. Yeah. Like it's some kind of old school street joke. But it is not. It is a part of, these are folk tales. Actually, a lot of Polish jokes are allegorical learning mm -hmm. but like you know the submarine with the screen, the door. screen door yeah, yeah. that's all, all about about war what is it good for <laughs> absolutely nothing i mean definitely not for the polish no no I, yeah, but the no, polish the also again they have brought it a lot of it upon do you themselves. Know, remember what jesus said to the polish when he was on the cross what's that play it dumb till i get back that's a dumb <laughs> that's again this is not real that was in the bible they cut it out it was in a lot of apocryphal books they found it in the Dead Sea Scrolls. Look it up. <laughs> Do the reading. Baby bird, human meat. Marcus, are you pumped for the 40th anniversary ween tour? 
I didn't know that was coming going on either. I mean, you people are just telling me everything that's happening. It's, it's his, great. It's his yeah. algorithm. Yeah, I don't know. This is incorrect. Yeah, so thank you. you. I mean, I, I do follow Ween, and I do get a lot of emails from Ween, but I haven't gotten one talking about a 40th anniversary tour. I know I missed them in California this year or last year because of the fucking subathon. The subathon was on fucking Saturday. I had these Ween tickets for a year on the Friday, but I couldn't go to the Ween show because I had to do the subathon. I had concert tickets and I went. Not to <laughs> I'm still having breathing problems. I had to choose one or the other. Oh, yes, Grady, thank you. Yes, I saw the email from the Cuba, but the Cuban exorcism ritual. I'm going to show it on my next available mandate. I can't wait. A uh, big herb. How can you hate the people who gave us pierogies? Exactly. exactly. It's fucking Eastern European empanadas. Pierogies. And everybody likes it. Everybody's got an empanada, every culture. Pierogies, overrated. I'm not even. I'm Eddie. You don't like. He doesn't like food. Right? Yeah, I know. Yeah, we can't. <laughs> you never know. We can't even deal with it. Yeah, yeah I, like, I love. I'm food. just glad. And that you I love. Understand. I love Polish food. The best food I've ever had in my life. I had in Poland. But You're already discounted. Your was word that? is no what longer. Uh, I had. It was this kind of sausage that was filled with pickles. Uh, and then another meal he that I had, like, like they just they fed me like a king, where they brought me boar and all sorts of assorted meats. Awesome. It was incredible. It was like oh, a yeah. traditional, like medieval Polish meal. It was, in, I mean, just Poland's food is just wow. It's so good. But well, pierogies, I hope they don't hear I've about just, your pierogies. Are fine. I just literally can't even imagine the idea of he took a culinary tour of, and I love the fatherland. Of Poland, and we were in Italy. I had pierogies. There were so many places. To I go. had pierogies in Poland, and they were still tasteless. All right, Gregory Cunningham. Oh man, I've been trying to stop picking my nose to prevent Alzheimer's, but it's so hard. We addressed it today. That is misinformation. Eddie was fooled. <sighs> Thank I God. don't think so. I think it's real. Yeah, Eddie was fooled, but it is not his fault. Yeah, right? I mean, I still delicious. think you should be careful when you're in there. No, yeah. I think you should be. Be careful. Don't make it bleed. That's the worst thing. All right, yeah. let's see this next one. Let's see this next one. Let's see, what, let's see what we got here. I want to pick my nose. Yeah, I know. Too. I do it now. Now I can feel free to do it. At three minutes, what took you so long? You were hanging out with Ethan, weren't you? Nothing happened. Something doesn't smell right here. Oh, I know what this is. Let me go. You're a bad liar, dude. You always have. What is this? What are you Honestly, showing me? What does he have that I don't? This is crazy, Shane. I don't see you that way. You You're my stepbrother, for Christ's sake. Uh, it doesn't mean that anyone in the pack even tolerates you. Boo I have you. your back. The Forbidden Alpha. I, I can't play these games anymore. I, think I want you, Adia. Only you. I don't know what you're talking about, Shane. Stop it, Shane. <laughs> Tuck your okay, shirt in. Again. Yeah. We'll stay out of this, Ethan. Dad, come to the school now. Shane's in trouble. Oh, this is a school. I don't understand. What the fuck was that? <laughs> it's just like, Big Herb says, is this what Quibby was? Yes. <laughs> I, uh, I know what this is now because I know because our intrepid manager, he sent me a link to one of these and he says, I think that you guys should get into short form soap operas. Is that what that was? It is a short form soap opera. It is. It is not one of Jackie's books, Book Thief. It is. It's a short form. Also, my yoga teacher, who also asked me to help her with her VO reel, and I helped her go on tape for one of these micro uh, soap operas, where it was all about her needing to get an abortion. Ah. Which is honestly, I was like, I'll do it. Yeah, but that was more. That was stepbrother. Romance on that one. Yes, it was. So. Yeah. Yes, it was. Yeah, yeah. That but was you're thing. my stepbrother. I think he's a wolf. I think he's a wolf too, because it's called like the Alpha something. The Forbidden Alpha. The Forbidden Alpha. Yeah. And he, he had big ass eyebrows. And he mentioned his pack. You're, you're the only. I'm the only reason why you're in our pack. Right. Oh. That's a, is that a wolf thing, Gurney? I'm asking you Packs because you know all that kind of yeah. stuff. You like animorphs and you like. Those wolves. are two wolf things. What is it? Oh, we'll, we'll see. see. We'll, we'll see. see. Oh, oh, we'll oh, see. Okay. Oh, okay. There's a second part oh, to the this video? is no longer truth. Sure, there's a lot going on. Right, okay, cool. okay. This is a bigger bit we wandered into and we don't know. Ah. But yes, it's a micro soap opera. That's what you guys like. That's what the Zoomers like. Is that true? No, they I They like know. the same shit that our parents liked? But they like it now in smaller bits so they can watch it when they're not going to school. Mm. Right, because then they watch it. Because instead of going, to, they don't go to school anymore because they get they pushed into lockers anymore. because they don't can't get. <laughs> no zoomers are working. Yeah, I see them working. Yeah, I see. There was like five guys over at the uh, what's this? But um, five guys. 
<laughs> the airport. They're always at the airport. <laughs> Silent squee. Henry just Google nodding. I know what nodding is. Nodding? <laughs> Oh yeah, when you the, your the penis, penis goes in and then it inflames inside. and then it gets stuck inside because it's the fucking wolf penis. We know. Okay? I didn't know what that was. We know. Well, now you know. Now you know. All right, Thank that's you. what that's what Rambo wants to do to Wendy. Mm-hmm. That'd be great. Honestly, no. I'd, I wish they could crossbreed, but we got rid of her guts a long time ago. We got rid of his. They could just fucking 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 nothing will happen. I yeah. honestly feel like Wendy's not super horny. I think Wendy's a lesbian. You think mm. so? Yeah. Does she and Carmi lick each other? Sixty nine. You disgusting fucking pig. You said she's a lesbian and she lives with another female dog. That doesn't mean not every <laughs> lesbian just immediately wants to be with another woman. Yeah. I think Carmi's straight. Yeah. That's why Carmi, Carmi got knocked up right off the fucking bat. She yeah. got knocked up as soon as she could. She's always kissing. Mm -hmm. That's why she's fat? No, she's skinnier now. She lost like three pounds. I saw her this weekend. We, mm -hmm. we lost weight. <laughs> she fucking lost weight. Look at her again. Wendy is a lesbian, but she's non-practicing. I'll tell you this, Georgie, secretly horny. You, you should see so? that dog at the dog park. Yeah. Mm. Man. Always busy. Man, when we brought Rambo to the dog face. park, <laughs> all the dogs like would lick his dick. It would drive me crazy. It's just, <laughs> they would all like line I, up and like there would this. literally be like a line I'm of sorry, dogs like one. licking his cock. And I would be like, what the I, fuck is you I'm guys all I you brought up nodding. Gurney sent the nodding comment. We're all talking about we're watching some show about wolves. We yeah. don't know. Is this the first round of like do Danny Ray, my dog is gay as hell. You understand. Yeah. yeah. Now, guys, do, do we want to start the voting now? Uh, one more. One more. All right, let's do one more. Got it. All right. Let's see what this is. I guess this is a longer bit. Or this is yeah. Eric. Okay. Yeah, this is going to be the one he did. The <laughs> is he cleaning something? <laughs> Is he just making mouth noises? <laughs> He's playing his beer. <laughs> what? What is this? <laughs> he looks like Stillgard <laughs> <here> too. <laughs> oh my god, it's so nice to see what's gonna happen to me. <laughs> Is there a way to get paid to do this? <laughs> this is what I want to do. <laughs> this is what I used to do in the bathtub. It is well produced. Yeah. There's a lot of money in this. Oh. <laughs> See, that's not an instrument. Yeah, anything's an instrument if you make it, man. Hell yeah. Yes, was it lazy, a teapot? Lazy the Planets is soup music. Yeah. Oh, man. <laughs> Come at me, bro. He's too old for this to be ironic. You know what I mean? Oh, no, this guy pump? was like a member of the theater of eternal music. Like <laughs> he's... He's just making noises. <laughs> yes, exactly. Trashly. Please cover this band on No Dogs. This is what I want. This is I the content trust I want. Me, the, the, fir the first episode of our Can series is actually going to be a lot of this. Yes, yeah. it is. <laughs> I've already heard a lot of the music coming out of there. It sounds like, literally, it sounds like someone's doing crafts. Oh, and then it turns man. out it's a music. I fucking love that guy. I, I love, love him. Spend some time with him. X Even though it's very annoying. Like, honestly, this is what the experimental noise metal folks are up to. Yes. Yeah. Well, who's that guy? Hermeto uh, Pascal. Hermeto Pascal. Or Pascal. And Pedro's Pascal. father. And that's just what he does? <laughs> that's yeah. great. He's a multi-instrumentalist. Multi-instrumentalist. Multi <laughs> oh, so. Yeah. <laughs> but got, but the thing is about too. that guy is that I guarantee you that if you hand him like a trumpet or a guitar, he'll fucking shred. Like, you think that, so? Oh, that, those guys are always incredible oh. musicians. Oh. <laughs> ah, but are you doing it with intention? <laughs> Artistic <laughs> intention. Uh. Polls, Polls are, are open. open for our first four videos. So Polls are open, but in, in Poland that means close. <laughs> Look, I'm a multi instrumentalist. <laughs> Don't understand. Oh, get the belly button. I love the belly button flap. Oh, your belly button's too far on your pants for it to work. <laughs> Are those me undies? No, Better they're mine. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You fucking piece of shit! Yeah. I got your ass, <laughs> and I will nail it to a fucking cross. <laughs> um, Tommy John's. Oh, nice. It's nice. 
Oh, God. If you're going to do it, man, you got to do it fucking right. What do you mean? Up in there, and then you... That's a really good timber. No, but I can... I can show you guys, like, you get a different tone. Okay, wow. We're famous. I'm a multi instrument <laughs> I only play the belly button. <laughs> well, it's like, well, cause uh, you I, you do have a good poppy. You have a good popping noise. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, yeah. I think oh. yours actually sounded the best, oddly enough. Thank you. Well, it's the acoustics. So. Well, he's got bigger hands. Yeah, and he's a percussionist. Yeah, you better be better. If yeah. it wasn't better, I used to play. No. I used to play bongos, congas. Yeah, I know how to do all that. Great. Now my question is: So you really <laughs> think that this fucking idiot? Knows how to play. Like, if you were to give him a saxophone, he'd know how to play it. I guarantee you, he he knows how to play seven instruments and he is fucking incredible at all of them. But all of them, he didn't even have any real musicality to what he was doing. You know what I mean? It was like literally, he was just going to the untrained ear, my friend. Nadine, that was not rehearsed. That was completely, utterly. In the moment, yeah. For some reason, I don't know why. (laughs) But you know what I mean? Like, like normally, I know what you're saying. Because, like, what's his name? The other guy who likes his wheel music. The guy you know, all who your likes... creepy guys. What are your creepy guys? What am I... But he's not not what's his name? They're gonna be like the piano has been Tom Waits. Waits. Now doesn't Tom, Tom Waits. Waits doesn't he make up his own instruments? Uh, Tom stuff, Waits like, does cre- he does he goes with a clang boom steam. He, yeah. he like creates percussion instruments. But yeah. he's very talented musically. Like Incredibly actually very so. talented yeah, musically. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. He's I a feel like wonderful pianist. Her, what's his game? Hernando de Soto? What's his name? That guy should have oh yeah, Pedro Pascal's father. Mm-hmm. He should have done a real song first. Maybe he did. Yeah, we don't know. It's just I want to see more I want to see more of that. A Shane Bird, it's about the notes you don't gargle. Very good. Let's see it. Okay, do we have the poll? The the results of the poll? Poll, We do. We do. We We do. We got the results. All right, let's see who wins round one. Uh, That would be me. Eric! Was that you with the old man? Yeah, that's him with the old man. The old man wins. That's good. That was a a tough round. That was a tough round to beat. It was really bad. That was a. I mean, we're going to find out more about this, what the, the children thing is. Yeah. We're yeah. going to figure what that is. It's some kind of euphoria thing, and we'll we'll find out. All right. Well, let's see another video. Is euphoria take place at a private school? No. No. No, they're all drug dealers and shit. Man, yeah, oh, fuck it. Whatever. Kelsey. They're jumping ahead, apparently. Okay, cool. Here comes Kelsey's video. Yeah! <laughs> yeah! Oh, cool. Did he get hit by a deer? Yeah, oh, man. That shit happens. Ooh! <laughs> that He's lucky he sucked. fucking lived. That had to hurt, dude. Yeah, of course. Wow. Those things are huge, and he got hit with the antlers. Why wow. did he attack? I guess he thought he was threatening him. No, it didn't attack him. He was just, it was a matter of circumstance. Listen to the noise. Ooh, what? <laughs> oh. <laughs> cool. He could be gored. We don't know. Oh, my. Yeah, That'd be might. sweet. Oh, oh shit. This is why I hate nature, dude. Hell yeah, man. I want to get T-boned like a car, like a good old-fashioned American. Mm. Amanda, I saw Paul Winter at his Winter Solstice concert, and they played whale noises, bird song, and wolf howls, along with the music. It was incredible. Who's Paul Winter? Is that like um, Edgar Winter? Yeah, maybe. That guy was fucking awesome, dude. Fucking love Edgar Winter. Yeah, Edgar Winter's real good. Free ride, baby. Where yeah. is it? What else? Frankenstein. Does, did he do anything else? I mean, Leon Russell's the best. You should do Leon Russell. Leon Russell's okay. You know, I mean, he's, he's not Marcus's thing. Yeah, no, not, I know. that's, that's not my stuff. That's just, you know, that's yeah. not my stuff. But what about Edgar Winter? Edgar Winter's not his thing. Oh, yeah, come well, on, how do you not know these things? I'm just saying, like, Edgar, I feel like he did an Edgar interesting Edgar Winter story. actually surprisingly shows up quite a bit in uh, in the series that we do, because Edgar Winter plays with a ton of really cool people. Like, okay. he's just sort of a dude. Yeah, he, he's a dude that gets hired, you know? Kind of like, um, uh, not Jeff Beck. Look at yeah. him. Yeah. Well, he's an albino. Is that a freak? <laughs> well, he's, he's just like, you know, he's fucking, he's dress up and shit. Yeah, yeah. 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 Oh, like, you mean like a funky freak, not like yeah. he's different because he's an albino. No, no not that kind he's of freak. He's a, not freak. Not he's a compliment. He doesn't need to be Let tortured your freak and murdered fly, fly. because he's, he's an albino. Guy, the good guy. Yeah, he's a, no, Edgar Winter is just like an amazing musician that just shows up all the time. Todd Rundgren's another guy that yeah. shows Todd up Rundgren. constantly. Uh, and yeah, Jeff Beck does show up uh, here and there as well. So well, he's yeah, unbelievable. These, these dudes that are just fucking great musicians. Right, Cooter? 
Ry Cooter showed up in... Joe Satriani? No, no, never. No, no, no. He's Joe's his own a, thing. No, no. Ry Cooter actually showed up in a recent episode. It was really interesting where he showed up. It was crazy. Fuck yeah. Yeah. Where he showed up in the fucking bathroom towel closet? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Baby bird, human meat. Deer runs at deer run at things as a defense. That's why they always get hit by cards. Interesting. That's a bad way, thing for them to do. Yeah, mm-hmm. they should learn. Because if right. not, they're just going to get wholesale and genocided. It's like Eric Dickerson, man, runs straight up right at anybody. Yeah. Oh, football. Yeah, mm-hmm. football thing. Don't cool. Worry. I didn't know if it was just a man you knew. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's see another video. Yeah, let's do it. Oh, Anders Butnick, can we give Marcus these bangs? What banks? What banks? I understand. These? Which banks? These ones. Oh, Edgar oh, Winter. Edgar Winter Winter Edgar Winter's Winter's bangs. Bangs. Yes, no. I wish. But he's not an albino. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, Those yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, no. I don't look good with the uh, the hair straight across. It makes me look like Jim Carrey. Edgar Winter has Dumb. a Scientology album, Mochi? That's fine. Oh, yeah. Was he a Scientologist? Uh-oh. Maybe. It doesn't count with musicians. Yeah, Beck. Not with Beck. Yeah, musicians are not very bright. Whatever so. this guy yeah. says, it's going to be on the money. Like, definitely whatever happens here is going to... Oh. Okay. Okay. Oh. Oh, God. <laughs> yep. Yes. Oh, boy. Okay. Are those pants? I hope those are pants. Yep. I don't think they are, though. Yeah, some, <laughs> something's rising again. Shush, shush, shush. I think I thought he was farting. This is—is uh, is it a man? I don't think it's a man. I know why. I think it's definitely. I, a man. I think it's a man. Yeah. yeah, it's always a man. I think it's a proud southerner. That right there, I'm a proud southerner. It's yeah, a new Ku Klux Klan can, uniforms. You can tell by the labored breathing that it's a man. Yeah, yeah, he's straining. He's rubbing his dick and balls back and forth on it. He's. You know, there's some sort of balloon action going on here. Yeah. Too. Do you some really think action. that this pink fox would have fought for the rebellion? Do you th- really think this gentleman? Do you really think that that that's Colonel Pink Fox? <laughs> do you really think that General Lee would I'm, have fought for you, sir? I'm guessing this is one of the guys that would die of dysentery before the battle even began. Look at yeah. the shameful way you have a thong barely covering your pink fox-like buttocks. I do appreciate the attention to detail on the hamstring. I truly love yeah. it. I truly love it. What's but, happening? Oh, it's inflate. It's getting larger. It's is this, is this hard on him? Do you not think that they would have treated you, sir, the same as they taught those? The tra- oh, they no. taught those whole, it's, it's the very <laughs> sad people. <laughs> ah! It's coming off. It's, mo- it's moving it around. Yes, so Jesse, few people correct. are their own bounce house. Jesse <laughs> is correct. This is oh, this is a Five Nights at Freddy's secessionist. Yeah. <laughs> yes, that is true. Yes, absolutely, <laughs> it is. A combination. No, oh, did he's he just move bigger. his tits? Yeah, he's moving stuff oh, around. Oh, he's inflating. Yeah, he's inflating. Oh, he's, he's been inflating the oh, whole time. Right. Yeah. yeah, he's inflating. Much like the issues between the North and the South. <laughs> Five nights at Antietam. As we, <laughs> as we head towards an Abraham Lincoln knew, he knew that this is who he was fighting for. These, Do you think he looks embarrassed. He's getting fatter. When he's not performing? He was at Charlottesville. Yeah. This mm-hmm. person... Uh, I. Oh man. His son does not talk to him anymore. You think he's got one? Probably died of COVID. Um. He's wearing a mask. That's I mean, true. that's the closest we get to it. George Lawrence, drag queens, furries, and white supremacists can unite, unite over this guy getting it wrong. You can, I guess so, because he's, for the furry community, he's right on the money. But it wasn't furry. Ah. He was inflatable. But that's, thinking, not, that's just more, it's a state of mind, not yeah. necessarily texture. I yeah. would imagine that the furry community likes to keep it as close to, like, a, I guess, biologically correct as possible. It's and all over the place. It, it might be all over the place, it's but true. I would imagine the mainstream furry community would shun such a man. I would probably go to tell you that there's such things a main no such thing as a mainstream furry community because they probably all view everything it's so difurcated i don't there's think so, so many different approaches no because some of them In are every subculture there are more subcultures but that's what i'm saying it's a i think it's a spectrum of subcultures i unfortunately know a lot about this they literally there's a whole subclass that views the anatomically correct and there's a whole subclass that goes more in the mascot cartoon version yeah. and so it's like those two but they are largely the same size but none of them are inflatable 
Yeah. Not necessarily, but it's cartoonish. So it's still among the idea of playing as an animal. Look at the underwear on that thing. If yeah. you go back to it, and you can see the underwear is really what sold it as a person. Melissa Z says you're supposed to rotate your tits every few months, which is honestly, it's so lovely because Nat lets me help. Um, <laughs> Kylie, I'm so glad I don't need this to get off. No judgment. It just seems like so much work. I do agree, but I yeah. feel like a, co a costume's less work than you think it is. Yeah. I think it's more of the hiding it from your friends. I think it's the... Um, the we don't know that he's doing that. We don't know. We don't, we don't know, know. That he's hiding it. it he could, could be, be a part a of a full-on Confederate furries group, which I know exists. If you notice on the wall right next to the Confederate flag was a furry poster. There was a bunch yes. of furries. Yeah, yeah. so I, he is definitely out and out furry. Do you? Does he think that they? It depends rise on if anyone in, comes by. Oh yes, I probably mm -hmm. be like ah. I, I, I guess he could be proud about were it. Furries, you know, with all those big beards, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Some of them did look like dogs. Um, this is a uh, Trashley says this is on par with the humping motorcycle gear, gear video. Yeah, I'd say it it's closer yeah, to again to, yeah. to texture. Yeah, is what I would say. But yeah, I, that guy is a. It's the. It's as pr he is as proud of the South as he is of his culture. The furry culture. Yes. Heritage, okay. not hate. Ah, <sighs> God. <laughs> Winky dinky, not hate. What's the name of one of these things? What's the name of a? What's the name of a? Of a furry? Of a, a what's the name furry? of a, like a little pony? My Little Pony? Um, Babadoo? Mister no. Mister Crunk? Uh, Mrs. Pink. Mrs. Uh, oh, Mrs. Pink. That's <laughs> Harry. Yeah, Harry. <laughs> no, nodules. Yeah. Um, yes, here we go. Spooky Bulbasaur just says, as someone who has gone to many anime furry cons, I will say that I am positive that this is a furry on a budget. So mm. I do think that that's the thing. Do you want to be that's a furry? a nice head. If you don't have the money, it would be difficult. Applejack, Twilight, oh, yeah, Fluttershy, yeah, yeah, yeah. Rainbow Pinky Dash. P. Pinky Pie. Oh, Pinky Pie. <laughs> Man. Oh. <laughs> yeah, Pinky Pie. I actually got this. I got an eighth of Pinky Pie at the uh, store yeah. the other day, and it was fucking great. It is a hybrid Satina Tiva leaning. Yeah. yeah. I had some Pinky P, and I called it Doc. You that should, because then that's how they found out that you had the chakas. <laughs> Let's see another video. One. I wish you had chakas. Me too. That was a fun part of your life. Gunny. Oh, that's yeah, fun. you did it. Yeah, you oh, did it, Oh, this guy. It. Yeah. Yeah, so you did it. This yeah. guy had 150 bugs. bugs in his nose. Yeah, he said that he had they felt pulled a, them out. He felt pressure and heat. Those are bugs that are literally Maggots, inside yeah. of his face. Yeah. Literal maggot brain. They are alive. Yeah. yeah, Mother yeah, Earth yeah. is pregnant oh, for yeah. the this third is, time. This is bad. Y'all have knocked her up. Oh, Gurney, I, I had saw this, and then we were going to do it for side stories, but it's too it was a visual. Very visual. Yeah, yeah, I know. It's very upsetting. I yeah. love the music, by the way. It is good coverage. Yeah, I like it. Yeah, the um, this guy, he was a, he's a fisherman, I believe, and he was like... Uh, Handling a bunch of fish and, and he, he wiped his, nose. his face. This yeah. is completely real. He wiped his face and took a parasite from one of the fish and jammed it up inside of his fucking and nose. And then it spread into 150 maggots. Wear and, gloves. Um, they're really, I mean, how are they going to get the ones that are super deep in there? Because they got seems, all of them. They got there them. seems to be a lot happening. Yeah. Like, there's they, a lot. It of, takes hours. It's like a cauldron bubble. I read an article about it. It, took, it takes a long period of time. Just cut my fucking nose off. Despite your face. Oh my god. But you know, this is, uh, I actually, I would prefer to keep the nose, but it's, get the bugs out. Yeah. You know, if you could. Look at all that. Look at that. that is what them. they've already pulled out. You could feed that to There's a very, more. very lucky bird. Yeah. Wouldn't that be nice? That's happy for the bird. Yeah, man. People are fucking weird. You, you don't know what can Was hide up Was that too much here. for Marcus? I mean, I didn't enjoy it. I mean, I thought yeah. it's too much, but I, I just... <laughs> Matt Junani, I cleaned up explosive dog shit so quickly to make the stream, and then for this, uh, abortion fairy. Never mind. I'm not worried about Alzheimer's in my nose anymore. Yeah. Now, this is a that that is one of my big like true obviously nightmares. Parasites. Of, yeah, that Covered kind of in, bugs living inside you, making yeah. you a home. But it also shows the the power of science. Mm -hmm. They did fish each one out one by one. I doubt he had insurance. Oh, mm. yeah, there's no, that's not. No, somebody took that on as a special case. Well, They're the, writing a paper about that. But I also yeah. feel like, from what I've heard, especially from nurses and doctor practitioners, is that that's the type of thing that they'd be like, yes! They yeah. like, they love that. They can't wait to scoop that's that That's why out. they filmed it. Of course, because mm -hmm. also, it's, well, that's just the camera. Mm -hmm. That's the endoscopy camera, so we can see where he's fucking, oh. where the things are. Because you notice that, that yeah. is the, that's live feed from his head. Yeah. yeah. It's fucking awesome.
Modern Bard said that was the first thing to make me turn off the stream. That's fucking the circle of life, dude. Yeah. You don't think those bugs don't have a reason and a purpose to live? Those bugs all were like, that was them They're hanging strong. out with their family. That was a Pixar neighborhood in his fucking head, dude. I do find it odd that that's the third time I've watched that. <laughs> I've watched it several times now. I feel like that we did a shorter version of it. Yeah, removed from the inside of his nose, the sinus, sinus cavity. This is obviously a Florida person. Feeling yeah. off. Um, he felt he felt off. But if, it took a long time for that many bugs to build up in his head without knowing it. His nose was huge. Yeah, it was all swollen. Yeah. But then, honestly, if you're already drinking a fucking fifth, whatever you got, All right? those fishermen's are drug addicts. Mm -hmm. Right, like, if you're drinking and smoking, you're not even thinking. You just think, like, all my buddies got huge swollen noses. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So he said, butt bags, McBucks for 20. This is true. They said that the suction wasn't strong enough to dislodge them out of his head. Because mm. normally they'd fish a little vacuum in there and suck it all out like they do with lipo. Yeah, but they were real deep. Real they deep. Really, really deep. Yeah, 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 yeah. Very hard to evict. Honeycomb. <laughs> <laughs> Let's watch the next one. That was great, though. That's great. Yeah, good work. That was great. Way to go. Really good work. We love it. So, okay, good. This one. <laughs> Is it a cheeseburger? It's a cheeseburger. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. Very simple. That's yeah. great. I Very simple. It. I still like, uh, so far, my favorite is the bugs yeah, and bugs the man with no best. talent. Yeah. The yeah. Bu what was the one before the bugs? The, um, it was the fight. The, the furry. The furry. Yeah. The furry. The furry man, yeah. yeah the furry. I still like. I, I like the bugs more than the furry, personally. But you guys vote on your own. Because you know what I don't Polls like about open. the furry? You know what I don't like about it? The hate. Polls are open, folks. Polls are like open. Personally, I'm a big fan of the cheeseburger. You know, I, I, I mean, I love cheese, cheeseburgers for well, peace every day. Mm -hmm. The cheeseburger know? reminds me of the video you used to show all the time that we used to do in the live stream of the Twin Peaks theme of the pizza the on pizza, the water. Boom, boom, yeah. Boom. Yeah, yeah, the Twin Peaks, my calm down video. Yeah. Yeah. Actually, I've got a real fun cheeseburger video coming up on my next mandate. Nice. Cheeseburger mystery. Ooh. You're going to love it. I'm very excited. And I really want I really want to see what your theories are on this cheeseburger mystery. I love this. No, I can't I, wait. I can't wait for this. I have a bunch of ones saved that I'm actually kind of, I'm, I'm excited for. So Oh but it's not going to be for the next mandate, because the next mandate is something else, but the mandate after that's going to be really fucking horrible. Wow, you're really working ahead. It's called trying to avoid how lazy I can become. Mm -hmm. yeah. And the key is All saving future me. I think about future Henry and how blissful he is. And then the problem is it because a lot of times I tell future Henry to go fuck yourself. Mm -hmm. Right? And I just do whatever I want. And I go like, oh, future Henry, you handle it. And all of a sudden, now I'm future Henry. And I'm like, what in the living fuck have I done to mm -hmm. myself? Yeah, and so I'm trying to help that man. Let's see what the polls say. Are the polls closed yet? Because Masca Angel says I feel threatened by the cheeseburger mystery. You don't have to. Cheeseburgers are great. They're my favorite animal. Don't worry about it. Everything's gonna be fine. Yeah. I wouldn't say you should feel threatened by the cheeseburger mystery, but it's odd. Cheeseburger. It's cheeseburger in a landslide. Whoa! Cheeseburger in a landslide. There we go. I would have never thought. Yeah. Oh, I think people hated it. Well, it's I hate it too. <laughs> but it's good as far as the show goes. It's good stuff. Carissa Trondle, I was just in the ER and overheard them getting a live roach out of somebody's ear. Uh, yeah. Oh! yeah, my mom used to be uh, work at PT back in New Jersey in the seventies, and they said one guy came in with a huge foot, and they put him in the whirlpool, and he took a uh, bandaid off, and a bunch of fucking roaches and bugs came out of his foot and ruined the whirlpool. <laughs> And they saw she moved to Florida. Man, I hope I can live my life so I can become the Oogie Boogie Man. <laughs> yes, the hamburger healed everyone. That's yeah. right, Cindy Gidden. All right, mm. we got. All right, let's see this. Let's see this next round. I want a fucking burger. Yeah, I know. All right, here, burger, taco, slice of pizza. Choose one. Burger. Stop it, Shane. Uh oh. <laughs> I'm not gonna say it again. Stay out of this. He's cracking his knuckles. Get get April again. Uh, I think you're, I think they're about to the Wolfie. Ooh. Okay. okay. In a situation like this, you always tear the shirt pocket first. They're all, <laughs> they're all, they're all like stupid Jacob Alordi guys. You want her just as much as I do. You really Whoa. think she yeah, wants to treat her like this? I think she's made it clear she wants a man, not a child. I literally thought the other one was the one who punched the other one. <laughs> they look exactly they look so much alike. Whoa, would just like our ancestors did back in the day. Bend over. Yeah, all right. First guy who comes wins. <laughs> okay, all right. Cool. Is this necessary? 
Wolf Hall, bros. Yes. Whoa. All right. Good all bodies. Right. Okay. Showing the bodies. It's all right. Who do who the real man is? Yeah, they Take definitely. Take that fucking chain, dude. Get some money. They're definitely Don't high school age. Know. He won't be bothering. Yeah, settled by sucking each other's dicks. Yeah, that's right, guys. Come ask anything. Stop this right now. Oh, uh, older uh, wolf man. Uh, we'll never get Stay get out of it. it. Stay out of it. Let the dogs fight. Uh, Trashley <sighs> says there are two wolves inside of you, and they're both boys, and they are kissing. Mm-hmm. You know, I I I do understand because you guys all like Gertie. Likes you guys all like this. You guys like high school stuff. I don't understand the high school kids fighting each other. I'm I mean, saying you, Gurney. Fight. You know why, Gurney? Because you dared. And I'm still I'm still fresh off of this. I watched what you did. And she posted a full-on commercial for Wonka to yeah. her social media. Really? And that is, I said, that is Timothy Shamaling Dong. You're not allowed to praise Sh- Timothy Shamalama Ding Dong outside of a Dune contest. I heard Wonka was actually pretty good. It's no way it's good. I heard I, that's There's, what I thought. But I, I'm gonna I'm gonna watch it. It looks it, I, what, who was the director? Oh, was I'm gonna pop director. a couple I'm gonna pop a couple Xanax and watch it on a plane. I watched Zone of Interest. My God. How I are told the, um, you buddy. how's the dance numbers in that? <laughs> <laughs> heard it was hilarious. It was so it was no, so I good. I can't yeah. wait to see it. Oh it's, you're gonna uh, love it. It's, it's probably yeah. the best Best film this year. Yeah, yeah, I can't wait yeah, to see yeah. it. So far, out of all the films that I watched, yeah, I mean, it's de- I mean, yeah, it's as a sound man, the <sighs> best, right? Well, not just that, but just you know, when they're hanging out in the pool. Yeah, yeah let's not go into it. I want to hear. I want to hear. I want to hear. In the train. Uh, yeah, I want to. I want to watch it. Yeah, you're gonna love but, it. Y- does Wonka go to the concentration camp? No, because that's where he should have <laughs> went straight he, to. He built one for all the Oompas. They gave them jobs. He's a capitalist. Oh, there we go. Controversial opinion. Oh, direct. Opinion. Timothy Chalamet is the best looking man on the planet. No, he's uh, not. Wrong. He's fucking tiny. Wrong. Mm. It is honestly, even after Dune, especially. I'll be our bird name. Very handsome. Yeah, I don't he think is. he's. Th- yeah, he's not even the hottest guy in Dune. He's not. He is not. That's true. It's no, Austin he's, he's not more handsome than Josh Brolin. Josh yeah, Brolin's Brolin. the handsomest the guy in that old look. Oh, yeah. That's a guy. That's, that's a, a man. That's a man. That's a man. That's a man. That's a man. Mr. Brolin. Let's watch the next one. That's a man. That's what I like. Big old big handed man. <laughs> what is this? It's fine. It's fine. It's, fine. it's fine. it's fine. It's for the kids. He's for a, the I know. Kids. I know. He's for the kids. Yeah. I get it. He likes scarves. We all do. <laughs> the pashminas was it the thing that made us all wear like Iranian gear. We all wore like pashminas <laughs> for a while, but we're not allowed to. But we're not Rachel Dolezal's. No, that was that was like a 2012 thing, right? 2010. Pashminas? Yeah, Pashminas. Yeah, it's like 2010, 2012. Remember that? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Everybody had one on, but then you realize it was like, a, but we all look like we all can We're coming out of the friggin', yeah. Yeah, like this. Yeah. I didn't wear one. I didn't wear a Pashmina, yeah, yeah, because I if wear, I wear yeah. a Pashmina, I, again, I just look like a fat idiot. You would mm-hmm. look good. No, I, I look, I didn't even know the way to describe it. I look like a fashion designer who was out of work. Roach, tall men that look like they're dying have the best dick. There, I said it. I've heard this. I've yeah. heard this about tall Is men. Is he tall? He's fine. He's skinny though. Yeah. Just saying, you're talking like I'm not sitting right here. But you're not tall. I'm six Yo, foot tall. Yo, that's Kylie Jenner's you're six? man what? now. Yeah. Chris Jenner might see this Timothy hate and a last podcast level will get shut down. Come for us, Chris Jenner. I like Chris. Come for us, man. Train us how to do it. Train us how to flip. All right? Make some money. Oh, is he dating the Jenner now? Yeah, I, I guess so. I don't know. Well, I don't think he don't dates anybody. I don't think they ever, they date. They just go into tubes. They choose. Yeah, yeah. yeah, and then they go into like these like kind of like Herman Hess-like situations where they like combine their, oh, look how yeah, happy they look. Yeah, they look really wow, happy. Wow, they wow. Wowed an, what an incredible life. She looks like she's 49 years old. She really does. What are these does. people doing to themselves? All right, let's go. I'm, I'm I did like father. him in the End of the World movie. He was great. He's not a bad actor. No. No, he's, he's very not a bad good. actor. He's, he's very good. All right, let's do the next one. Oh. <laughs> oh yeah. That yes. is he carrying Fago. Yeah, this is, like a, Fago. yeah, this is my fucking. Yeah, I like yeah. This. this is love. Oh. This is real love. Oh, just do it, Juggalo kid. wedding. Oh shit! Wow. If the married couple gets on the rascal and leaves together, <laughs> that would be the best. <laughs> yeah. That's how you do this. Oh my god, she's beautiful. She does look beautiful. 
Oh, that's cute. That, that is, is cute. cute. That's cute. Juggalos deserve love. Yeah. Juggalos deserve love more than most. Yeah. They actually, they are. They believe in family and all that shit. Yeah. Very this loyal people. Nice. Yeah, Harrison Westfall, Michigan or Arkansas. I don't know. But a combo of the two. I find this to be very sweet. I, I think this is very, very sweet. So fun. Maddie, unfortunately, I think this backfired. We fi- I think that this is pure love. I think yeah. Maddie also finds this very hey, sweet. Yeah. Oh, but it's, they're going to get Fago. Yes. Yeah, oh, yeah. Yeah. Man, dude, wear huh? jeans at least. <laughs> That's fun. Yeah. This is lovely. How are you going to wear a long sleeves and short shorts? I don't know. It's a look. It's a, it's a, it's a look. It's a vibe. Does he have an axe? Yeah. 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 Hey, wait, you guys. Don't get in a weed. That's mine. Yeah, it's a wedding, you little bitch. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Fago, Fago. Hell yeah, yeah. Oh my god. Yeah, good for them. It's so funny because this. I guarantee this. They'll be together forever. Yeah, yeah. no, oh, yeah, that, yeah, that's the yeah. love that's gonna last a long time. Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. What W. Teffy is this? I lost my virginity to do a juggalo. Of course. Yeah. Wow, that's a Abortion Fairy, we just said the same thing. Yeah, I think this is real. This is real love. This really is. Because they, I mean, they share something. They so get deep. each other. They yeah, get, they each, get other. each other. They didn't kiss. I will say that. No, they did not kiss. And they forgot the ring part. Yeah. Well, everyone was. I think. Well, they're not known for the I, organization. Yeah, I mean, you I just gotta drink. You gotta kiss each other. Just wheeling around. Yeah. <laughs> uh, well, I think the. It seems like that the officiants got really excited with the fago. I think they fago too early. Yeah. Uh, it does seem as if they were all more concentrated on the concept that they were gonna squirt them with the the soda instead of the marriage. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah but yeah, that, I, I do. So. But that's not their. Brogan. I wish that, you know, you get, you get a proper officiant, someone who's uh, got all the beats. V, to what address shall we send their wedding gifts to? I think that we should send it to what is the state penitentiary of yeah. Michigan? I think I, you just put a bunch we, of stamps on a fish. And you put this kind of it that it way. Um, the Great Malenko <laughs> Way. <laughs> 69 420 Great Malenko Way. I love um, <laughs> I love pasta. I'm married to a reformed juggalo. He got it covered up, and I know the Hatchet Man tattoo is still there. Underneath yep. is that what, what's, is the Hatchet Man? Is it like Great Malenko? Is it one of the characters within the Hatchet, Juggalo world? Yeah, Hatchet Man has been a symbol throughout the Juggalo uh, mythology Why from the very great, beginning. I feel like Great Malenko is not used enough. Well, the Great Malenko was a part of the uh, I think like the seven cards. The Great Malenko is just one part of a larger mythology. Yeah, yeah, yeah that the was Malenko, just the hit. Yeah, the Great Malenko was just like the, the break, break the Malenko. breakthrough album. <laughs> <laughs> that but was just the was, breakout album. I thought that was the there. I thought that. Was was like their god. Was no, the I think Malenko. it was just a character no. in the overall like cards, like seven something. There was also Jekyll. Um, I have a vague understanding of Juggalo. It's mythology. so sad that that one guy's got that heart defect and he's gonna die anytime soon. Yeah, can't do Juggalo. He can't Juggalo anymore. One of the main. No, no, that family's gonna live forever, oh. and they're gonna have seven <laughs> more kids. And it's gonna. But no, the the Juggalo. What's his name? Not um, I think the, one, the skinny one. No. Nah. Yeah, it's not Violent J. Yeah, I think it is Violent J, the skinny one, yeah. Mm. Oh, she with the deadly bite said, my ex got a black sun tattoo, and he didn't realize it was the Godsmack logo. Oh, yeah. uh, Which is probably yeah. how they got the logo. Yeah. Man, that's fucking sad. Wait, what are you going to do? Godsmack is just not for everyone. I know Godsmack is like, you know. That's a sub- much rather, a Godsmack wedding's way sadder than a juggalo oh, wedding. Oh, no, a Godsmack yeah, wedding doesn't happen. Yeah, 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 yeah. A Godsmack, a Godsmack yeah. wedding is not possible. Yeah, that sounds like a nightmare. Can you imagine a stained themed wedding? Uh, uh, I'm on the outside. Uh, I'm I saw them at an Ozfest once, and they just like put their heads down yeah, really yeah. low. Yeah. And they just play the card. You know, it'd be a fun See? wedding though. Corn wedding. Oh, oh corn yeah, wedding yeah, yeah, would be incredible. Yeah. Oh yeah. All day I dream about <laughs> nuptials. <laughs> Rookie yeah, yeah, yeah. B, Henry, how much would you charge to officiate a wedding? I do that shit for free. If I, you really? just gotta catch me. Yeah, I, I feel weird charging. What? No, a lot of people charge. I know, but I feel weird. I feel weird doing it. I but mean, it would have to really work out. If it's a stranger, me. you charge. Yeah. If it's a friend, you do it for free. Yeah. That's how it goes. Interesting. Yeah. I don't know. We'll find out. Well, now I'm charging. How many more videos we got? We got. Two, Two more. more. All right, let's, well, show let's show them so we can get to the voting. Yo. I got one of these on my block. That's your block. 
<laughs> it seems like it. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! What is this book? Death Cat. <laughs> this is great. Wow! I love this. Whoa! It's <laughs> <laughs> good quick thinking. <laughs> oh no! Is he got a garage? Yeah, is he choke? Is the cat choking him with a yeah. garrote? Yeah, it's an assassin. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? Can I pet that down? <laughs> pet that down. Oh, this is what great. Is, what is this? This is the best dog cat fight I've ever seen. How long? It's supposed to Whoa. take him weeks. Oh, this was a long time ago. We did this a while ago. This one. I don't. I don't remember this at all. Oh no! It just no. killed him. Oh shit! No! Yo. That's, <laughs> That's awesome. Fucking Wonder what year we did this. Again, we just realized we've been doing the show for fucking eight years. Yeah. What is that? Man. Fuck that cat. Yeah, pro cat propaganda. I know Joel's a cat guy. He is a cat he's man. He's a cat man. He's I know cat he's man. a cat man. Um, I know why you did it, Joel. The yeah. cat. The cat, not Whoa, death cat. Oh, that's How awesome. I'm going to watch that. I want to watch the cat from 1992. It's from Japan, according to Jesse. It's an adaptation of a novel called Old Cat. A like cat a from outer space teams up with a young alien girl and her knight. I got it. We got to see this. Along with an adventure cool. novelist. I got to see this. Wow. Show me your hams. Anybody else remember Eddie's story from Roundtable about the mastiff that had to be killed by its owner? <sighs> I mean, we don't have enough time for this story. Yeah, let's <laughs> wait. I mean, we do yeah. enough dog killing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah. that's a really, I like that. Yeah. I like that movie. I, I want to watch that. I'd love to watch that movie. I'd love to do dabs and watch that shit. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, most of my nights are spent watching movies like that. Most of my days are spent loading my guns. You don't have any fucking guns. <laughs> it's called acting. <laughs> <laughs> round we table. Well, Buttbags420 just hit me with a round table started 14 years ago in May. In June, but yeah. Wow. I feel fine. My back hurts. <laughs> I'll say my back hurts. <laughs> That's 14, years 14 years ago. Yeah, only so. reason I know is because it came right after my hernia surgery. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, it started but it started before your hernia. Yeah, such a fat man. Like that in. is such yeah. a fat yeah. man memory. Yeah, it started <laughs> before because you had the <laughs> Yeah, that was before my fucking dick tried to revolt against my stomach. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, cuz we had yeah, we started the show and then you were gone for a little while and then you came back too soon. Yeah, because uh, I was all pilled up. Yeah, you were super pilled up. That was real fun. Emily yeah. Bassick, my dad is recovering from hip replacement surgery. Can he get an all hail? Good work to your father. Fucking hail, uh, brother. Hail. Man, hail give, your him hip. That, give him that hip, buddy. Yeah. Get that hip. Hip, hip hail. Not hip. All right, so let's get to this last, last video, video so last we can video. do the, the, the voting on this one and then the overall, oh, the so, Battle Royale. So organized. Fuck's lasted here. 14 years. 14 years of this. Perfection. Oh no, oh, God! Yep. Please leave her. Yeah, yeah. No, uh -oh. don't take her. Don't take her. Please don't take her. Uh -oh. Oh! <laughs> God, I oh. would definitely have gotten up. Oh. Uh. Yeah, you gotta get up. You gotta oh. get up. Come on, guys, get out God. of the truck. Oh. That's all right. That's not even bad. I mean, she's okay. That's not even I mean, bad. Okay. She's okay, but yeah, I'm sure she lost she's a lot hurt. of skin. Yeah, I mean, she de yeah, she definitely spilled. But that. she's back. But oh God! Oh, oh God! Oh. But he should have oh. gripped her. Ooh. It just kept going. What? Hey, hey, hey you got hey, a lady. You grabbed the lady. It's really funny that the guy goes to complain to the garbage man he instead of helping the woman. Ah! Like, <laughs> it's like, that's, like up? that's the most not my job shit I've ever oh, seen in my yeah, life. Straight you know? up just like, <laughs> just like going, it's like, you got to take care of that lady. Yeah. All right. Bye. Yeah. Yeah, man. See you soon. Yeah. That's so funny. That's so funny. Yeah, he went straight to the guy. <laughs> Being like, see what you did? Um, the guy whose whose username is just the word fuck. Where does Ed fall on the butt scale of Henry No Butt to Marcus Huge Butt? Mm -hmm. I'm right in the middle. Yeah, he exactly where I'm sitting. Yeah, he, he is pretty. He is pretty close. To I, the I, have, I have. Yeah, I have a very small butt, but luckily Henry's is negative. Yeah. 
Why do you mean luckily? Well, it means that mine, you know, takes the attention off of how little mine is. Mm-hmm. Yo, you think that us walking together? Yeah. It's like people look at your I butt. Look fu- they're like, and they're like, fine Whoa, ass. that's woo, wow. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. And then they think that, oh, be like, oh, not that guy. Yeah, just a big X ah, comes mm-hmm. on the screen, like no, Family dude. Feud when they see no. your fucking butt. I feel man. like women see no butt and they think room to improve. Mm. Mm. Open. Right, Both are, are open. open. Yeah, Margo, we are sitting in butt order. But yeah. Margo's butt, people also talk about how huge his butt is, and it's not that it's huge. Not it's not just well huge. shaped. It's a nice ass. It's fine. It's a really yeah. nice. I've gotten many compliments. I'm going to tell you, you can slap it going straight down. Yeah. Truly, though, I have seen better asses on men. Yeah, sure. I yeah, mean, I'm not course. saying it's the best ass yeah. in the entire world. We were I'm looking just at Tallywhackers. It's today. better than average. Do you remember Tallywhackers? They were just showing the fronts. What was Tallywhackers? They got butts, too. Oh, I didn't see the butts in the pictures we saw today. You go down. You got to look down. Oh, you've been tally whackers is the Hooters for for women. It's a men. It's men in Hooters. It was in Dallas. Yeah, yeah. there was only no. one of them. Yeah, I remember tally whackers now. Oh, fuck says butt measure mandate. We're not doing this. Yeah, no, we already done. No. No, oh, yeah. so the, the thing that Amanda you're ashamed says. of, you don't get to, we, we have to avoid. <laughs> yeah, Amanda we already slapped our stomachs for you fucks. <laughs> says my sis, Amanda, my sister's butt is so big that her kids can stand on it if she tries to give them a piggyback <laughs> ride. <laughs> and I'm sure she loves you telling everyone. And your <laughs> name is Amanda. Yeah, you just <laughs> love Amanda. But honestly, that's a good butt. If you got shelf... Mm-hmm. That's, that's nice. That's unless, where the butt comes in. Unless that's a, a uh, extra butt Brazilian butt. BBW. Yeah, yeah BBW. Yeah. 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 yeah, and then that's bad. Yeah, it is. Well, it's not. I actually don't think it's bad. I, it's not a judgment call on you. Just it's not very healthy. You got to be careful. A I, lot well, of them, if you're getting them, then they're not. It's BBL. It's not a BBW. BBW is the woman. Yeah. The BBL yeah. is that. But BBW I, is a big, beautiful woman. Yes, it is. Yeah, yeah. Yes, it is. But then a BBL is something you can get done. But Brazilian butt lift. Buzz, Brazilian butt lift, but they can pop. All right, so what do the polls say on round three? Looks like Joel's taking it with cat person. All right, dog. Joel got it. Right. Joel so got it. Cat person. So we. So now That's we got one. cat person. We got cheeseburger, cheeseburger, on, the cheeseburger on the windshield. Cheeseburger on the windshield. And we've got the multi instrumentalist. Yes. Yes. Everybody's favorite man who makes noises. Man, who is going to win? I think the cat is the coolest. I think cheeseburger. But the old man's. Blatantly the most talented. I think that yeah. my favorite of the three is the old man, but I think that Cheeseburger is going to win because people have that in their hearts. I think it's their heart song. You think so? Mm-hmm. Yes, I do. Yeah, Jesse, that- I cannot think about the gal from My Strange Addiction who put straight concrete into her ass. Yeah, that happened. Wow. Sure. She got a lot of she got yeah she got oh, a lot of trouble. Yeah, that's she it's just trouble. Well, well personal, personal. Oh, trouble. personal, yeah, personal yeah, yeah, trouble. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Funeral <laughs> sandwich says I heard <laughs> Holden's taint is 15 inches. He doesn't have a taint medically. They removed it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yes, it's Eddie's taint that was 15 inches. Mm. It's very, mm-hmm. very long. Yeah, yeah. Holden just has four assholes. Yeah, they chant is chanting cheeseburger in old caps. <laughs> oh wow! So yeah. it seems that the cheeseburgers are yeah. really coming through. They today. really like. I mean, I'm well, I love the cheeseburgers. Well, I think the cheeseburger is what you'd call a mood. You it's know, a, it's a like, vibe. It's now a they vibe. say my because yeah. back in we, it used to be mood. Mood now, but now, now it's, it's a vibe. vibe. It, yeah, it, it is a there. vibe. Hang, hanging in there. Yeah. Yeah, in the rain. It's like that cat poster. Yeah. It's because the chat went through a trauma together and we bonded with the burger. <laughs> Everyone was upset about the video, the, the uh, insect video, which is honestly still my favorite of the day. I think it was the, I mean, well, I mean, the old man was so good. Yeah, the old I just man still want to see the old man play an instrument other than noises. And then I will be super into it. Mm-hmm. It's like, it's always about sandwiching. If you put one, like, I need one thick bass lease. Man, I far- started find- following all these bass algorithms. You know yeah. who you would love then? I got the perfect artist for you. Moondog. You'd love Moondog. He's exactly what you're looking for. Because I like ba- I like Jaco Pastorius. He's, an, he's yeah. an old man, plays jazz. Uh, he used to be a street musician in New York for like years, for decades, and they finally put him on record. I've heard of this and it guy. was incredible. But it is like really cool jazz with some fun noises. That's what I like. So, M- Moondog, is it, you're going to, I'm going to send you a Moondog album tonight. It's going to blow your fucking mind. I'll That's tell it to both, both of you. You know what? Both of you to a lot Moondog. of is Pharaoh Sanders. Oh, Pharaoh Sanders is incredible. I've been getting really into him recently. You know who you really need to go move on to after that? Alice Coltrane. 
Alice oh. Coltrane. Alice, John Coltrane's wife is it, just out of this world. It's, you've been. Yeah, I still listen to that album. That I'm listening to the album right now. That Andre 3000 album. Yeah, my is, flutes. It's a combination of. It's basically a combination of Alice Coltrane and Pharaoh Sanders. Yeah, I love it. Alice Coltrane. No, I know. I love it. String trilogy. Oh my god. Andre 3000, man. I just fucking get cheebed out of my mind, dude. I go look at leaves. Dude, Alice Coltrane. Like, have is you gonna... done that yet, guys? <laughs> have you gotten the highest balls and went look at leaves? Look at fucking listen to the the, the, the new blue sun. That's what you guys got to do. Get on my fucking gay here, man. Zoloft. Take my search for lean. I fucking go out there. I rip a dab. I go out there. I'm looking at leaves, dude. <laughs> fucking listen to my fucking listen to sounds, dude. Transcendence by Alice Coltrane. It's gonna be your new favorite album. I'm fucking dead. I'm fucking telling you. Mark, I'm telling you. Mark is doing everything he can to stop the show until we start talking about weird music. Then he's like, fuck it, we'll just stay in <laughs> Yeah, yeah we'll just talk about this. The Shane Bird. We have uh, results. Shane Bird, his last Marcus Rec had me net blasting Nazi music in public. <laughs> was it? I don't know which one that was. You you reference a couple of Nazi bands. Well, you mentioned what's the Gluba oh, Gluba, whatever the bad Death one. And, and Death then, in June. Yeah, yeah, and the other one. Yeah, yeah. That's. I don't know what that has to do with Alice Coltrane. <laughs> That's what they did. At all. She's did. not a Nazi. No, right. she's not. She's just a wonderful woman. All right. Still, so what's the results? The, yeah, what's the results? In third place, the old man, her metal Pascal. Ah, ah, whatever, dude. Come on. Second fucks. place. Yeah. Joel's cat versus Doug. Oh, wow. Cheeseburger. Cheeseburger takes it. Congratulations, a. Michelle. Michelle. And Michelle, you win. A. Be, don't be too excited. I don't know if you're watching right now. A $25 gift certificate to Jersey Mike's. They don't have burgers. But you get to spend it here you in LA. You get a cheesesteak. Yep. That's a fucking horrible, horrible, piss poor prize. Yeah, well, that is piss poor, Henry's my out friend. of cash. That is piss poor. That's, That's what piss poor. Piss poor. It's like, it's like to me, it's like a $25 gift certificate to Jersey Mike's. It's more like $20. And yeah. Jersey Mike's is terrible. It's right. all right. <laughs> Jersey Mike's is good. He doesn't know. Don't. He doesn't know. He doesn't know. He doesn't know. Um, and he doesn't know. Jersey Mike's. Oh, yeah. Jersey Mike's. You can go to this wonderful three-star restaurant. That's that right. is exactly. Hey, man. Sometimes I'm looking for three stars. Yeah. All right. Sometimes they five slice stars the meat right much, in front of you. I like Jersey Mike's. Too much sugar in the bread. I don't like the bread. So, as much. Lot, so the first one you gave Gurney a hundred dollars cash. I was forced. Yeah. And Michelle is getting a twenty five dollar gift certificate to a middling sandwich shop. It is not middling. It you is can in give the middle. Something if you want. Yes. You know what I might? Hell yeah. Yeah, uh, I might. I might to make what are you up. Do? To make up. Firehouse. For yeah, I mean, seventy-five dollars to Fire Firehouse. Fire, firehouse ain't bad. They, <laughs> Why are you seventy-five dollars you, you to Firehouse? Give, you got to give her something that is in New Jersey. No, they're Jersey coming Mike's here. is in New Jersey. Yeah, do you seriously think that she's gonna come here to New York, to L.A. for a week and do nothing but eat at Jersey and eat at Jersey Mike's? Is she coming to town? Yeah, next week. Oh, that's great! Can't wait to see her. So she can spend her good Jer Jersey Mike's certificate. Yeah, I'm sorry. We'll see. Marcus is going to make I'm up the rest of it, you. so we'll find out. You're going to find out what Marcus gives you the rest of it. Congratulations, right. Michelle. <laughs> 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 Mouth Penis 24 says, I went to high school with Andre 3000's son, and his name is Seven. Hey, man, he plays flute better than he man. fucks women. I can't I don't believe know that. Why he named himself 3000 and his kid Seven. Yeah, right? yeah. so he knows you got to earn 2,993 dad points. There's so much more Moog synthesizer in that album than flutes. I don't know why everyone's called the flute album. Because he's playing the flute. Because Andre 3000 Actually, he women. plays much more bass clarinet. Then he does flute on that album. It's a fucking, we just, just let me have it. We like talking about flutes. <laughs> it's a flute. It's a flute. It's a flute. All right, guys. I'm just saying it's inaccurate. Yeah. Our chat will donate. No, we're not taking it from the chat. Chat doesn't no, donate 50, 75 dollars. No. We can do it. But Marcus has to figure out what the rest of the, you'll figure out the other half of the price. Yeah, I, I, actually, it would be three quarters. Yeah. I think we can get Henry up to like 35 bucks. You think so? We'll yeah. see what happens. Well, I mean, I'm buying it and sending the, <laughs> sending the receipt in, so I can buy whatever I want. Yeah. That's <laughs> <laughs> true. <laughs> All right, guys, it's been a wonderful last stream. Good work, staff. Good Hell work, yeah. staff. Yes. As always, Good work, thank staff. you. you know, like, crazy. All of this is fucking great. You horrified everyone, and we will be back next mm. week doing it up. Because you're one week you're in, and the next week you're out. Cheeseburgers for peace, baby.
<laughs> All right, let's see here. No, I said stop. Father, why are you here? Have you lost your mind, my son? How dare you challenge Alba Ethan? <laughs> I am so sorry, Alba Ethan. I apologize for my son's horrid behavior. I appreciate it, sir. But I'm not the one who needs an apology. Are you deaf? Apologize! But he was violating a deal. I was the one protecting her. It's not true at all. You're the one who's been violating me. Whoa! Papa Joshua, Ethan did nothing wrong. I said she was in trouble, sir. That's all. He was trying to make her his mate. It's our true destiny, apparently. Apparently. Ethan, you should know as well as anyone. You're only allowed to select a mate within your own pack. Yeah. yeah I'm aware of the pack rules, sir. Oh, the tables have turned. I should have talked to you about it first before sharing my feelings with Adia. You should have. Well, I cannot stop this if it is truly what you both want. You really rolled over fast on that. But it violates the rules, Dad. Dad, Dad quiet! Was... Both of you. I can hear myself think with all this yapping. Thank you for your understanding, sir. For dogs Does are pretty hairless. How I feel about all this. <laughs> Shut up! Shut, Shut up! up. <laughs> and that'll mean that. Though. How do you feel, Addy? I'm not sure. I mean, you're a great guy and all. But you're not my yeah. stepbrother. Keep going. <laughs> and you did save me from Catherine. Mm-hmm. And Catherine. Yeah. But any guy can say that it's destiny to get the girl. How do I know if that's true? Shoot him with a silver bullet right now. <laughs> so you just have to wait and find out. See you in class. <laughs> Remember, they are at school. Let's go have sex with your mother. <laughs> That'd be the. <laughs> oh, God. Watch on Shore TV. Whatever. That is what Quibi was supposed to be. Yeah.